Hey guys, what is up? It is Laura from Laura Murray Plans, and today I am here for another weekly plan with me. This week I am planning November 15th through the 21st in my Aura Estelle A5 Wide Planner using my Aura Estelle inserts. I am using the ultimate kit this week called Once Upon a Fall by Scribble Prince Co. And then I also incorporated rose gold foil. So I have this, um, I'm not sure if it's a matte bundle because it's in glossy, but it's a um, white and rose. It has like white sticker paper and then rose gold foil on top. So I incorporated that. I think I just incorporated that for the bottom washi and maybe the sidebar headers. I don't think I incorporated it too much. Um, and then everything else, I just used rose gold foil. I tried to stick with like Scribble Prints Co. and Cross Presses rose gold because I really like their pinky rose gold and there is so much fluctu fluctuation between all the different shops rose gold. So I tried to use that one, um, those two shops the most, but I did incorporate some other rose gold as well. I decided to use the extra box that came in the kit the fairy girl with the ombre hair because I thought it was cute. I have, well, I kind of have like balayage now, but I started my hair with ombre. So I figured it would work, but this is my last fall kit. I, well, I have one more kit next week, which is going to be my Thanksgiving week, um, which I don't really consider fall, but it is fall. It's going to be, I'm using the Chris kit from Scribble Prince Co. Also. Um, so this is, my last like non-holiday fall kit I guess and then I have my Thanksgiving kit and then we're getting into Christmas which is so exciting um so yeah I'm really really excited for this plan with me um I think I might do plan miss but I need to do like I need to ask everyone on my stories their ideas because I cannot upload a video every day. I'm just too busy for that. Um, and I just, I can't do it. Like shout out to people who are doing that and who can do that, but I'm not going to set myself up for like failure. And I feel like it'll just be really stressful to try and get that all done. Um, so I don't know if plan miss doing it three days a week is the thing. Is it still called plan miss? I don't know. Um, so I got to do like some IG polls. Um, again, follow me on my Instagram at Laura Marie plans if you don't already. So yeah, I just used, um, I think I just used miscellaneous rose gold foil. I had actually, I didn't use like a full foil bundle or anything this week, but I think this kit turned out really, really cute. I love the elements in this kit. I have no idea who did this art. Um, but I don't think I have used much art in my planner by this person because it definitely stands out and is super duper cute. So yeah, this is the base of the plan with me. I hope you guys have been enjoying my little formula of doing a talk through through the base and, or sorry, a voiceover through the base and a talk through through the day by day. It's much easier to talk through the day by day because I have actual things to talk about. But when I'm laying down the base, I'm just like, I'm not going to bore you guys with me talking nonstop about random stuff you guys probably don't care about, which is also probably part of my talk through through the day by day. I talk about stuff some of you guys probably don't care about, but it's okay. Um, at least there's less of it now, but, um, yeah. So again, I just, oh, I pulled in the twinkle, I think from Scribble Prince Co. I love the twinkle. It's my favorite, um, like foil base. I don't know what it's called. Foil, foil format. I like the twinkle. It's really fun. Um, and then I did just use, Hole protectors, hole reinforcers, whatever they're called from Crest Press. And yeah, I'm loving how this is turning out. Thank you guys for watching. And I'm going to hand this off to actual talk through Laura. Bye. Hey guys, it is actual talk through Laura. And I am here to film the day by day of this week in my planner um, for the week of November 15th through the 21st. So I did do this base. Um, it's looking real cute with the rose gold. I love that I used rose gold with this kit and I'm really liking how this is looking so far. Um, for the sidebar, 
Oh, first I'm gonna put in the November script. So let's use this flag here from the um, one of the sheets in the kit with this November Scribble Prince Co. script in rose gold. And then I did want to mark Oliver's age again. Still marking it. Maybe I'll stop. Oliver. I am currently, I have Oliver with me. Um, because Jake is playing Dungeons and Dragons in the study. So he's with me and he is just getting into everything. But, um, what was he saying? Oh, maybe I'll stop doing the, should I just do one of my faves? Yeah, I feel like these colors are just so fall. I can use one of these. Um, and I just love these doodles. These stickers look so much like a freaking doodle. Like, it's barely, like, there's not much facial expression or anything, but it just looks like exactly like a doodle. Um, yeah, maybe I'll stop counting how his age in the new year. I don't know. It's kind of fun. I'm also almost like halfway there. So until, uh, 40 weeks, which is the countdown because it is a pregnancy countdown. So yeah. Um, okay. So I'm going to put this in. This is again, my puppy Oliver's weeks. This week he was 17 weeks. So I have that, and then I will figure out something else to put in this box down here later. Um, so on Monday, sorry if you can hear that, my heat just turned on, it's actually freezing. Otherwise I would have just bared with it off, but I am freezing and I'm like never freezing. So I run very hot, so. Yeah, um, I am going to use a combination of half cut headers and bougie boxes, which may be kind of annoying for you guys, but hopefully not. Um, it's just my way of like semi saving money. So yeah, on, um, oh wait. Should I use a flag on Monday? Then I need a bougie box and I already put that box down. Um, we'll use this guy. So on Monday we did go to the vet, which is by where my parents live, except neither of my parents were home. So we literally just drove all that way um, to have Oliver get his last shot. And this was his last shot he needed before his last social shot he needed. So that was really exciting for us because you guys will see, we take him to the dog park later. Um, so we did go to the vet and then we did get bagels after and Starbucks. Um, I like was craving a bagel. There's not really good bagels by where I live in or where we live um, in Virginia. At least we don't know as well. Um, so I knew there of a good bagel place that was right by us there. So we just went there because that's like the area I grew up or Jake and I both grew up in. And so we know all the good spots down there. Um, and then I did get Starbucks, of course. And then this day I did work out. So I'm just going to mark that right there. Um, okay, so for the vet appointment. Oh, no. I feel like this one doesn't really match. But I might not have very many options. Mm. I mean, I do. I think I'll just use one of these. It's fine. This is from the mini occupations from Once More With Love. So I'm just going to put this in. Super cute. And a vet appointment script from Letters to Apollo. 
And then, like I did say, we did get bagels, which I got a ham, egg, and cheese bagel. And I'm, like, really weird. I don't really like a lot of the egg, especially in, like, fast food, like, the way it's cooked. I think it's so gross. Um... But I've been more, I've been trying to get more into eggs lately. I like, like, there's, like, really good eggs in, like, Thailand that I eat. Um, oh, wait, I feel like this one would match, which I feel like I can never use this one because it's so brown. So we'll use that. Um, so I got a egg ham and cheese bagel this day. And it, it was the biggest piece of egg ever. And I don't know, it, like, makes me nauseous. And I just, I'm not a big egg person. I really like hard boiled eggs, but that's literally like it. So yeah, I really did not eat much of this bagel. And then I did get us bagels. Um, to go like to take home for another day and then we like never ate them. So that was a waste, but oh well. Um, so this bagel sticker is from Beneva Creations. The bagel script is from a food sampler sheet from Planahanna. This is a Once More With Love pumpkin spice latte sticker. And the Starbucks script is from Letters to Apollo. And then I was going to use a bike sticker this week. Kind of change it up because I do work out on my Peloton. Or I did this day, I guess. Um, so I was just going to put that there and I have a workout script from Scopal Prince Co to mark that. Um, okay. And then moving on to the next part of the day, I did do some laundry. Let me go ahead and put this down. Half cut headers are much more annoying, but they are way more cost efficient. Um, so let's see, I guess, um, let me start from the bottom actually. I did cook dinner this night, which I don't know what I cooked. I did not write what I cooked, but Maybe it was, I've been cooking like really good chicken lately and just like broccoli and it's been so good. And yeah, we really have been liking that. Um, okay, I'm gonna have to do laundry in a little thing. That's all I needed to figure out. So I'm gonna put that there to do some laundry this day. Um, why do I keep losing my half cut headers? And then I did pull stickers. So I'm just going to use a piece of washi for that. I'm going to use, I love this pink color. So cute. It reminds me almost of the, my bridesmaid dress color. In my wedding that all my girls are wearing um and then use this ah shoot okay and then Oliver did go in the dog park for the first time today this day which was really exciting because he is so freaking social Maisie was like not social at all. She did not like other dogs. She was just such a like lover of humans and that's it. She wasn't like mean to any dogs. She just was literally like antisocial and just didn't want anything to do with them. And then Mochi was like not really socialized well because we got her right before lockdown in Maryland. And so she just, oh, she just never really got socialized because, like, it was the middle of COVID being really bad here. And so we weren't leaving the house or anything. And her breed is also, I don't think Shih Tzus and Bichons are as social of dogs, too. So that could be another 
factor in it. Um, but Oliver, oh my God, he is king of the dog park. Everyone is like, he's so cute. Cause he's like literally the youngest one allowed in there right now because he just got his last shot. So he's just, he is the cutest in the dog park. I'm not going to lie. Those two are from Scribble Prince Co. Um, but yeah, so he just, any type of dog he will want to play with. He's not scared of any dog. Mochi is like not socialized well, like I said. And, oh wait, maybe I have a fall planning sticker. I really want to try and use up some of these fall stickers. So yeah, let's use some fall stickers this week. Um, she only likes dogs that are smaller than her. This one could match. Um, she's terrified of any dog that's bigger than her and she's 13 pounds. So that is a large majority of dogs. I'm going to use the one in the middle here that is more fall like and doesn't have any Halloween elements. Um, cause I did pull stickers this day. And so anyways, Oliver is just, oh my God, he is so freaking cute in the dog park and like everyone is obsessed with them. They're like, people are like, he's the softest dog we've ever touched. Yeah, he's super cute. So it's been fun taking him to the dog park. Oh, we can use one of these stickers. I love these. These are from Happy Daya. They're really big, but... It was a monumentous occasion. So I'm gonna put that in from Happy Daya. And then I did cook dinner, which I did not write what I cooked. So we will use a generic cooking sticker, but yeah, we're super excited. We can take Oliver to the dog park now. And yeah, the reds match this red, which is nice. Um, It's just been great for him. He's so happy, he loves other dogs so well so much the breeder did such a good job like socializing him sorry if you can hear him he's drinking water or eating um they did such a good oh my god they did such a good job socializing him so yeah it's really nice um okay I'm just going to write in Ollie's first time because I have a dog park sticker right there. I will be back while Oliver eats. Sorry. Okay. If he proceeds to be loud, then I will give him off to Jake um, in the study while he plays Dungeons and Dragons. But it is so much quieter since I put a gate on that dog park. But... I am nice and I'm not like, if, if someone wants to come in, I'm not like, yo, you can't come in. Um, I don't want to sound like a cop. Jake says I sound like a cop. Um, but I do let people in. I just like feel like it was getting a little overboard with it turning into a community thing. But anyways, um, after I cooked dinner, we did watch Sunday Night Football and then... I was in my feels this day, um, kind of like in a fight with Jake, kind of, but then we cuddled after, so not really. Um, <laughs> but let's see, I'm gonna use this. So there we go, that works nice. Okay, so for Sunday, or Monday night football, sorry, I have this rose gold football from Planahanna, as well as a Monday night football custom also from Planahanna. This is my combo for primetime games. And then um, I might have a fight with Jake Sticker and then it's funny because I'm literally gonna mark us cuddling after. Um, but it's good to not stay mad at your partner forever because that's just not healthy or fun. Um, okay, let's see if there is a fighting sticker in here. I don't ever know where I put them. Ugh. I have too many stickers with Jake. I really do. No, they're not Paper Shire. They're Whimsical Cat Studio, so they'd be somewhere here. Ugh. 
Oh my God. This is a problem. Here I am two days before Black Friday and I'm gonna go and buy more stickers even though I clearly have a problem and I have too many. Oh, here, found it. Um, oh, huh. I'll use this one. It wasn't really a sorry crying kind of fight. So that's cute. I love that sticker. See, it was worth looking for. Okay, and then I did cuddle him, so I need another freaking. Let's just use a paper shire sticker. Um, is there like one in bed? Because I think we cuddled in bed. Um date night dinners. Oh my god, here. I'll just do this one. Okay, I'm sorry. I apologize that I have so many Jake stickers. I just should either mark more stuff with Jake so that I can use up some of these stickers or just stop marking stuff with Jake so that I don't ever have to tackle this again. Um, okay, and then I do have a cuddle time script. This sticker's from Paper Shire. Ooh, I'm kind of just wanting to cut off. Actually, we'll use one of these and maybe I can use the cuddle time later. I do have a different format of a, of a cuddle script that will work like that. Okay, so that is my Monday and I don't even want to know how long that took. Um, moving on to Tuesday, I'm going to... I'm gonna put something here so that it stays down. Okay, on Tuesday, I'm gonna use more half cut headers. Um, I did have a virtual appointment with my gyno and um, oh no, first off, I had a day off. I took the day off because I was just not good mentally. Honestly, this week sucked. <laughs> it sucked. So, yeah. But anyways, um, for my day off, I'm just going to use this here and I'll put the script over it. And then I did, like I said, have a virtual doctor's appointment um, which I'm probably not going to discuss, but yeah, kind of sucked TBH. Um, okay. <sighs> I need to focus. I'm going to use, um, this for that. Ah. And then I did get Starbucks and then I took a nap because um, there was just a lot of crap happening this week to me personally. Both the news I found out at this doctor's appointment and um, some stuff I was going through on another end. So it was not the best week. And then um, Jake did get me started because I was feeling like crap after my doctor's appointment. And then I did take a nap, which I can probably just use a little thing for. Um, let's use this guy. Okay, this is a little crooked. Perfect. Okay, um, so for my day off, I'm literally just gonna put this sticker in the middle here. This is from a Caress Press foil bundle. I had it left over and I thought that was cute, fit super nice. Um, for my virtual doctor's appointment, I'm probably just gonna use a doctor's sticker um, with the navy. There's not really navy. Um, I don't know what to use. I guess I'll use one of these guys to mark my virtual visit. 
Um, and then Starbucks from Jake. I'm going to use a Starbucks sticker here. And I have a from Jake script. Super cute. And then I did take a nap. Um, I think I had to wake up early for my stupid doctor's appointment. I don't even think I had to wake up that early, but this was just not a great week. I'm going to use this one from Once More With Love that says Cozy. And I have a nap script from Scribble Prince Co. Okay. Um, and then... I'm gonna write in virtual gyno appointment. Okay, I did try and use like a lot of Scribble Prints Co. and Caress Press foil because I prefer their foil better and it bothers me that not everyone's rose gold matches. Um, just in general, that not ever, that uh, there's so much fluctuation. Obviously, it's no one's fault. It's just something that's like a pet peeve of mine. Um, so I've been trying to just buy rose gold from like Scribble Prince Co. and Caress Press because I like their rose gold. And I feel like I already have the most foil with them. So I might as well keep it like concise or all uniform with that than like changing it all. I don't know. Um, but I definitely like the pinky rose gold more. Um, okay, so... Um, we did go to the dog park. How do I want to do this? I think I want to do our date. We did go on a date. Like I said, I was in a mood. And so Jake was like doing all these nice things to try and cheer me up. Um, so I'm going to use this and then I'll use this at the bottom. And then this, and then I just need a little thing. Let's do an orange one. Okay, so first we did go to the dog park once I woke up from my nap. Um, which Mochi is like so weird in the dog park. She's, I don't know, she thinks she's like, got all the protection in the world for me and I'm like nah like if you're gonna growl at a dog mochi then you gotta deal with the consequences sometimes um but no she was fine it was just like she's so little and she like talks so much game and then like has none so yeah anyways um oh let's use one of these let's use this one this is super cute from Teddy Plans Co and I have a park script, which I don't have any dog park scripts in rose gold. I did buy a bunch, but um, again, I, I try not to buy rose gold from a lot of shops just because there's so much fluctuation. Um, so I did just use these park scripts, which I think they mean like generic park, not like a dog park, but... I know what it means because of my other sticker I put with it. Um, okay, and then Jake and I did go to Melting Pot on a date, which was so nice. He like insisted and I was like, oh, okay, I'm not saying no to Melting Pot. Like I'm not that sad. Um, no, I'm kidding. But um, I wanna see if there's like fancy, fancier date night. Can you guys hear that dog barking? I love dogs, but like some dogs bark so freaking much in this neighborhood. Okay, I can't find it. Um, I really am enticed to use this heart. I just think it's cute and I think the colors will match. And yeah, I just think it's really cute. Um, so I was gonna mark that we went on a melting pot date, which <laughs> it was so funny. Melting pot. Okay, so for their cheese fondue, I love the Wisconsin cheddar and I love the green apples that go with it. I also obviously love bread. And then Jake likes the grapes. Um, and then 
the salad. We love, love, love their Caesar salad. It is the best Caesar salad ever. They're, they're, oh, I don't know what ever the toppings are that they put on them are so freaking good. It's amazing. So yeah. And then for their, um, for their entree, we get the moho and then we get, I got a Jake caught some like thing that was all fancy. I got all three. I got to create your own and did all three teriyaki sirloin. Their teriyaki sirloin is the best thing ever. And like, I know what good teriyaki is. Okay. Um, <laughs> it is so freaking good. So I got all three of those. We got it. And Jake was like, you're not finishing that. And I was like, yeah, I'm probably not. And then I did finish it because it's that good. Like I can't usually eat that much. I will not eat stuff I do not like. And oh, this why can't i find the fetch stickers um this teriyaki sirloin is so good so if you go to melting pot you don't have to get three orders of teriyaki sirloin i'm not saying that but i am saying i used all these fetch stickers oh my god i need to get more of those that's crazy hmm i guess i'll use this one um I am saying try their teriyaki sirloin. It's life changing and I just love melting pot. And then for their dessert, we, I mean, it's all good. We like their flaming turtle. I like their flaming turtle. Jake likes, we got their classic this time because we took it home to go. Um, but yeah, I love melting pot. It is so good. It's a place that I've been going to like all my life. And then I introduced it to Jake and we just go on spontaneous date nights there. We did like our prom date there, um, dinner there. Um, we, we went there for our six month anniversary and now we're like almost at 10 years, nine and a half. Um, so yeah, it's just like a fave place of ours. Um, and then we did get home and we played frisbee with both the dogs, which was hilarious because, so Jake tells me the only dog he has ever seen, and he knows a lot of dogs, he has ever seen this, cus this is a custom from Adorably Amy Designs, um, do frisbee is Mochi, which is so funny because like I said, she's like a 13 pound dog and she's just like, I, I don't even know how she picks it up. Like she's so low to the ground. She She's not very tall the way Oliver is especially, but she's like not tall at all. So like she has to lift her head, her neck like really tall to like be able to carry the Frisbee so it's not dragging on the ground. But we're trying to get her to teach Oliver because we think it's the cutest thing ever, like a dog playing Frisbee. And I've never seen another dog play Frisbee. Jake hasn't either. Um, he had three Goldens growing up and he still has never seen a dog play Frisbee. So um, we were like, my mom gave us two frisbees because she has all the frisbees because mochi plays with frisbees um she gave us two frisbees in mochi's bag when she dropped off mochi and so we played with them this night and oliver's just so dumb he like tries to catch it and is like stepping on his paw with the frisbee while trying to pick it up and it's like bro you're like holding it down like otherwise you would get it and it's Mochi's just so into the Frisbee. It's so funny. And she's so good at picking it up and Oliver cannot figure it out. So I'm sure it's a work in progress, but for now I'm just like, um, I'm just like, yeah, like we gotta, have mochi kind of train him how to use a frisbee so that's what we did that night on wednesday i went to work all day and then after work i did meet um i did meet a new family that i am planning on babysitting so uh, I don't know if you guys remember my company is closing or my company's location is closing. I think I said that of whenever it happened, I talked about it in the, in the voiceover or talk through part, whatever. Um, so my company is closing and I need like a temporary, 
actually I should use a quarter box for this. Um, I need, oh, this is going to be annoying, a temporary thing to do. And so my solution was to babysit because I have like every single degree ever to work with kids. And it's just an easy job for me, to be honest, um, because I love kids and it's just something that doesn't feel like work, which I think everyone wants. So um, this is going to fit. Uh, it's good enough, whatever. No, I hate that. Is there like another size box I can use here? No, no, because I don't have the washi sheet. All right, so let's just put another half cut header in in between this. Okay, sorry, I'm like really trying to figure this out. So yeah, I found a family to babysit and so I met them this day. I'm gonna start babysitting them in December when my company is officially closed which is just so exciting for me. <laughs> so I have this work script from the Crash Press foil bundles. And then for visiting that family, I was gonna use a kid sticker. Um, if I can find them. Kids, okay. I do have like a whole kids section because like I said, I work with kids. Um, oh, this kind of looks like her. Let's use this. We'll use this. I'm babysitting a girl, so I figured that'd be cute. And I'm just gonna write in, meet new family. And then I did have a call with my mom who was in Florida at the Kennedy Space Center where she does her work. So I have this with mom script from Planet Hannah and a phone call um, icon from Scribble Prince Co. And then I did FaceTime my dad because he's in Thailand, so I have to FaceTime him. I can't call him. Um, so oh, I don't know where my call stickers are. Oh, probably on her phone. Because it is FaceTime. Okay. Um, oh my god. I feel like I'm going really slow over this plan with me. I'm sorry, you guys, if this is really long. I'm, like, re really trying to relax tonight. It's the Tuesday um, before Thanksgiving. And I ha it's last week for you guys. Almost a little over a week ago for you guys. And I had, uh, I have tomorrow off, so I'm just trying to chill and enjoy this and kind of like, you know, take my time. I promise they're not always like this. You guys can tell they're probably not always like this, but I'm trying to do that today. Um, okay, and then I have this FaceTiming sticker from Once More With Love and a With Dad script from Planet Hannah. And then I need another bougie box. I finished this sheet. Um, okay, so then, oh, sorry, um, I think I'm going to do two labels, something, I'm using a lot of labels, but oh well. Um, okay, so this day we did start the show Sex Education on Netflix, we've been recommended to, um, watch it by so many people so we finally started watching it and I'm not kidding it is my new favorite show ever I feel like I say that about every show but this one so good I'm obsessed um yeah uh we just finished season two I was so mad by the ending uh, let's use a plane um so mad by the ending like oh I could cry um but yeah I love 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 this show it is so good I'm definitely gonna rewatch it I never rewatch shows but I'm definitely gonna rewatch it because I was like really hesitant to start it because 
I'm not, I don't really like a lot of shows, but I feel like all the shows I've been watching lately that people have been recommending have been on their A game. Um, so I don't know, but yeah, I feel like I've been really enjoying the shows lately. Um, I'm going to put this on this. That will look super cute. because It'll stand out a little more. That's so cute. Um, but yeah, this show is my fave. So I didn't really like watch the first few episodes um, like intently. So I finally started paying attention and I'm obsessed. Um, it's like got me sold. I'm definitely rewatching and I just think it is such a good show. So yeah, I'm obsessed with that show. We are still watching. And then um, Oliver and Mochi, oh my God. They were doing this thing where they would chase each other around our bedroom. And we have like um, a king size bed in the middle of our room. And so they would run around it, around it, around it and go under the bed. And like, that's how they, it, it was so freaking funny. And we were laying in bed. I think it was... Tuesday night when we were laying in bed they started this and then Wednesday night it was the last night of Mochi being with us for a, a little bit and um they started doing it again and it literally felt like they were like I mean there were dogs under the bed but it literally felt like there was like some living creatures under our bed just it felt really funny like we could feel them on our mattress where we were um laying on top I don't know how to explain it but it was just so funny they were chasing each other under the bed like wrestling each other under the bed it was just really really cute um so I wanted to mark that and then I did just cuddle Jake so I am gonna write that I started sex education um and then what Oh, Ollie and Mochi. I'm just gonna write in Ollie and Mo under bed. And then for cuddling, I'm, I guess I'm just gonna cut this script. Because, ah! Oh! Okay, I hate when that happens. Um, so I just don't want a whole big script on top of that. So that is super duper cute. And that is the first half of my week. I'm sorry, this is taking forever. Okay, so on to Thursday. I did put down a bougie box because when I know I'm gonna use a like quarter box or a rounded box, it is easier to just go ahead and lay that down. Uh oh. Okay. Um, so on Thursday I did go to work again. My work has been like super weird lately because my company is closing. So like it hasn't been as consistent. Um, but I did go to work this day and then I did get Starbucks after work. And then my mom picked up Mochi because she got home from her trip. So I said bye to Mochi. And then... We did get Popeyes for dinner this night. I think Jake really wanted it. I'm not that big on Popeyes. Um, but yeah, so that was that. So for work, I have another script from the Cross Press Foil Bundle. And then for Starbucks, I have this sticker from Once More With Love and a Starbucks script from Letters to Apollo. And then I did say bye to Mochi, which I guess I put my dog stickers away. Let me pull those back out. Uh, I guess I can use kind of a bigger one. Um, oh, I kind of want to use this because this one reminds me so much of what Mochi looks like. I don't know if if you guys follow me, you might have seen a picture of her. If you definitely, if you follow my personal, you have. But she's like half Bichon, half Shih Tzu. And doesn't this remind you of that, like, Bichon face? She looks more Bichon. So I just like that sticker. And then what did I say? We did get Popeyes. Um, which 
I guess I'll look under, I don't know, is that fast food or is that, I guess it's American food. Um, I don't really know what to use for that. I guess I could use one of these guys from Fox and Cactus. Okay, so, and then, oh, for Popeyes, I do have a script from Plana Hannah. Um, okay, so I am gonna write in Bye Mochi. Um, right there. And then moving on to the next part of the day, we did watch Thursday Night Football. Um, huh, how do I want to mark this? Do I want to do, no, I only have one more quarter box, so I don't want to do another double thingy. So let's use, um, A piece of washi for Thursday night football. We'll use this guy. I'm gonna attempt to use half cut headers here. I feel like you guys can definitely hear my heat. I'm sorry. I will try and be more aware of that. Again, I'm not like a hundred percent sure what you guys can hear because Jake does edit it. So yeah, I mean I listen to it obviously, but I don't know. Anyways, we watched Thursday Night Football, and then we did Cuddle. Let me put this, like... Um, we did Cuddle, and then we did just binge sex education. So, let's see. Let's use... Um... this guy for that sex education season one was so freaking good oh my god I loved it and then in between here like what will fit now literally nothing oh this is the struggle I'm just gonna cut this box unless this box wants to fit no I'll cut it. It's fine. I'm sorry, you guys. I'm, like, really struggling here. I think it's partly because of my bougie box situation. I'm not going to lie. So, it's definitely my fault. But I'm trying my hardest. Bougie, or, sorry. Planning isn't always very luxurious. I need boxes like this size, I think. That is my problem, is I need boxes that fit like this um like more boxes where I can do two labels and something in the middle I guess or whatever I don't know anyways Thursday night football I have another football and custom script from Planet Hannah primetime football combo and then I am just gonna put in my Netflix binge at the bottom here. This script is from a Caress Press foil bundle on the TV. Oh, you guys can't even see. I'm sorry. It's from Scribble Prince Co. Golly. And then I did Cuddle Jake. Lots of cuddles this week because I felt like crap. <sighs> okay. Um, what will work? I feel like these ones kind of match. Um, this one kind of looks like cuddling. Because of the blue and the pink. I don't know. His yellow hair definitely does not match though. Um, okay, and then I am going to cut this cuddle time script because I think that will look nice. Cuddle time. And this is from Scribble Prince Co. Oh, that's super cute. There, you guys can see it finally. Okay, moving on to Friday. 
Um, Friday, my client called out sick. So I had the day off, which I don't think I marked, but I did have the day off. Um, so first, I want to mark that it was Loy Cretong, which is a Thai holiday. Um, I actually have stickers for it from Paper Shire, so you guys would have heard about it in my haul, my Paper Shire haul that I did maybe last month. I honestly don't remember, but she does have stickers for them, which is really exciting. So I definitely had to mark that in my planner. Usually I wouldn't, start, unless I was in Thailand, I would, but I don't do anything for it here in the States. So I probably wouldn't. Okay, I just ruined that glitter header. I'm not even gonna try and fix it. Um, And then, oh, so what do I wanna use for that? Let's use, uh, We'll use a, let's use this orange piece of washi for that. And then I did get Starbucks. And then I did film. What did I film? Oh, I think I filmed the first part of my November haul, which, oh my God, my birdies making sense order is cray cray in that haul. So yeah, be prepared for that is all I'm going to say. Um, so yeah, I did film and then I did do some planning. So let's use a label for planning at the bottom. And then for filming, I will just do another little thing. need a pink little thing. We'll do this. Oh. Okay. That works. Um, so, oh, where's this holiday sticker? Oh, it's right here. Oh my God. I knew I would need it next because it's in November. Okay. So this is the holiday. I'm definitely going to use one of these. I would love to use this, but I don't know. Maybe I could put it at the bottom, but I does the blue match? I don't know. I think I will. It's so cute. I could put it in the sidebar, actually. Yeah, let's do that. I don't have anything else to put. I could put a fall sticker, but I mean, this is just so cute, and it was literally this week, and like that is the holiday. And yeah, so these are from Paper Shire. Shout out Paper Shire for having those stickers. I am going to write that in. Um, and then, like I said, I did get some Starbies. So this guy here from Once More With Love and a Starbucks script from Letters to Apollo. And then I did film. So I do have this really big filming icon from Scribble Prince Co. And a film script also from Scribble Prince Co. And then I did do some planning. So I'm gonna pop in one of, oh wait, do I have? Uh, that doesn't really match. Okay, let's use one of these, another one of these from the, Halloween planner sheet. This one's more fall, so it works for this spread. And I do have a planning time script from Scribble Prince Co. Um, moving on, let me have some of my smoothie to come out and got me a smoothie. It's so good. Oh, okay. I did hang out with one of my best friends this day. I actually went to DC to pick her up and the traffic was so freaking bad, but I did it for her because she wanted to come meet Oliver. And so I was like, yeah, she doesn't have a car because she lives in DC. When I lived in DC, I didn't have a car until like the last month before I knew I was moving to Virginia. Um, but yeah, so I went to where she lives in DC and picked her up and the traffic was literally awful. 
it took forever um but it was fine because i got to see her and then um oh my god all okay do you if anyone else has a puppy puppy farts are so bad why does his farts smell so bad they're so bad apparently it's a thing too like everyone's like oh haha -ha, puppy fart and i'm like i did not know this was a thing i don't remember mochi having puppy farts so has not been enjoyable um anyways i hung out with my friend alana and then uh what did i do oh we watched more sex education and then we did get mcdonald's this night so um, for hanging out with my friend, let's go into this, my friend stickers. Um, I could do the car one because I picked her up. Um, let's do this one. I feel like these colors do really match with this spread. That's from Moon Skull Cat Studio. That's super cute. Um, she I am technically this one, and she does not look like that one, but it's fine. Um, I can be that one, she can be that one technically. Um, and then we did watch more sex education. So I have this TV icon from Scribble Prince Co. And I binge watch script from Letters to Apollo because we were binging that. And then we did get McDonald's. So let's go into here. I don't know. I feel like the red is not an exact red. Um, I'm use one of these from Carly Plans. I love this Nuggets sheet. I love chicken nuggets from McDonald's after they've been in my air fryer. I do not, I cannot eat McDonald's if it's not like crispy and like good um so i'm gonna write in here hang with alana and then i do have a mcdonald's script from plana hannah super cute on to saturday i'm gonna take another sip of my smoothie On Saturday, um, okay, let's do another one of those combos because I feel like that works really nicely with the half cut headers and I can kind of save my bougie boxes a little. Um, on Saturday, oh my God, this was so recent. This was literally like a few days ago. I'm filming this really early this week because Thursday is Thanksgiving and I just want to like chill, so after tonight after I'm done filming this I'm just gonna chill um anyways on Saturday I did sleep in so let's use a piece of washi to mark that and then we did do some fall photos <laughs> I really wanted photos of Oliver on Jake's like nice camera that he takes good photos on so we let's use this guy um we went out on a walk and we just took a bunch of photos um with the fall foliage which most of it was down but it was still fun mm. Okay, whatever. So yeah. And then we did go to the dog park after that, which was part of our like fall photos. He had a blast in the dog park this day. He's like best friends with like a black pug. And he and there was another black pug in the dog park yesterday. And like, I don't know, Oliver's not the smartest. He definitely thought it was the same black pug. And this black pug was like not into Oliver pawing his face and doing what he does to get attention from dogs. Um, so yeah, he was just like 
not having it with Oliver, that other black pug that Oliver got confused. I don't know. Um, ooh, this kind of matches. So yeah, it was kind of funny because I, he definitely thought they were the same dog and they weren't. Um, but yeah, so for sleeping in, I have this one's more love sticker and a sleep in script from Scroll Prince Co. It's literally massive. Um, and then for taking pictures, it, they were fall pictures. So I feel like I could use like a fun fall sticker. Ooh, maybe one of these, except there weren't really pumpkins. <laughs> Again, super applicable with my stickers. Um, oh, this is cute. We can do this fall one because they were fall photos. Oliver looks so cute. I posted, I reposted some on my um, uh, planner Instagram story of um, Ollie and me, and they were so cute. Um, yeah, he just looks so cute in the fall. His, like, red slash brown on him is, like, goes perfectly with the fall leaves. So, yeah. I'm, like, just talking so highly about my dog right now. Sometimes he's a real pain in the butt. I'm not gonna lie. Anyways, this take picture script is from Station Stickers. This fall sticker is from Once More With Love. This sticker is from Teddy Plans Co. And the park script is from... Scribble Prince Co. because we did go to the dog park and Jake was taking photos of him playing in the dog park, which were so funny. Um, so next, I am going to do another one of those combos because it works really nicely. So we did go to Jake's cousin's house, his aunt, uncle, and two cousins. His two cousins are, should I just use, I'm just going to use the last pattern one of these. I've never used all of these, so I'm really excited about that. Um, his cousins are like 13, almost 14, and 9, so they're not really like close in our age. Um, so we went over and it was so funny. His his 13-year-old cousin, okay, so I used to actually babysit both of them. Why is there something on this? I used to babysit both of them and I, um, the younger one, why is there, I'm just gonna use a different one cause that's just gonna piss me off. Um, the younger one, I lit like literally was born after we started dating. So like he's known me his whole life and I used to take care of him. Like I used to f change his diapers, everything. I took care of him when he was a baby and, um, Okay, finally done. That is the annoying part about half cut headers. I am not gonna lie. Um, which thing should I just use? Yeah, let's just use this one at the bottom. So yeah, anyways, I don't even know what my point is that I'm trying to get at. I've just known them for so long. I'm actually really, really close with them. I'm closer than Jake is to them. Um, so it's it was fun to see them again. We went to their house and they have a five-year-old dog who is super cute and playful with Oliver. And um, they're just super nice. So it was fun. Do, do, okay. So, okay, what do we want to use? Should I just use a fall sticker for visiting them? Because I don't really know what to use for visiting them. Um, we didn't have pie. She did say she wanted, she's like an amazing baker. She used to actually make like custom um, cupcakes for people, which was like my dream job at the time when she did that. So it's just really funny. Um, but... She made us like these amazing cookie bars. I don't know. They were so good. She is like the best baker. Is that the word? I know. Um, okay. I really don't know what to use for visiting them. I'm thinking I'll just use the pile of leaves. Call it a day. I don't want to hold you guys here any longer than I have. <laughs> 
Um, okay. And then we did get Smoothie King. I'm sorry, I'm going so slow. I feel like half of you guys probably already exited out of the video. Um, if you watch this whole thing, please let me know because I love you. You mean the world to me. I'm going to use one of these coconuts. I've been using these in the fall to mark my smoothies because the browns really match. And then I have a smoothie script from Randy.Plans. And then, like I said, we just watched more sex education. So I have a icon and script. I think I used all these um, Circle TV icons to mark sex education this week. I kind of try and do things intentional like that. Um, so those are both from Scribble Prince Co. Okay, on to Sunday. I kinda, I don't know. I'm like running out of half cut headers. I think, no, I kinda wanna reuse the rest of these actually. I was gonna go the lazy route and just say YOLO. I'm doing bougie boxes for the rest because I'm just like so overdoing these half cut headers, but I'm going to buy so many bougie boxes on Black Friday. It's not even funny. I cannot do this to myself anymore. Um, so on Sunday, I did sleep in again. I was so tired um, this weekend. I've been like really sleeping in too, which isn't ideal. Oh my God. Ugh. Okay, sorry. I lost my sheet of half cut headers, my new sheet. Um, and then Jake got me Starbucks again because he's an angel baby. So I'm gonna mark that with this guy. And then I did get Jimmy John's this day. I just love getting Jimmy John's on football Sundays. I don't know. It's like almost a craving at this rate. Whenever football's on on Sundays, I just want Jimmy John's. So got my Jimmy John's this day. I get the Slim Five, which is the Italian, and it literally says perfect for kids, um, which I think is so funny. I did not know that because I've been getting it my whole time, my whole life. And one time Jake was like, when after we took a break from Jimmy John's and then we went back to it, Jake was like, you get the Slim Five, like you get the slim ones, the ones that are for kids. And I was like, for kids? He's like, yeah, they're for kids. And I was like, oh, and I was just, I just think it's really funny because, um, I don't know. I don't usually order from the kids menu and I just had no idea that I basically was. So anyways, after that, we did watch Sunday football as per usual. Um, I'm leaving my stickers everywhere left and right. Okay. So for sleeping in, what do I want to use? Um, this one's kind of cute. Like that from Once More With Love. And then I do have a sleep in script from Letters to Apollo. This, I hadn't used any from that sheet, so I was like, I might as well. And then Jake did get me Starbucks again. He's gonna mark that with this sticker from once more with love and a from Jake custom from Planet Hannah. And then Jimmy John's gotta take out my favorite sticker, which I should probably order more of from Fox and Cactus. I definitely should, or I should just find more different sub stickers. There's gotta be some out there now. And then a Jimmy John's script from Planet Hannah. And then we did watch some football. So got to pull out a football sticker for that. Um, oh, the yellow doesn't really match. I hate how yellow those helmets are. Oh, I feel like the red matches. And the Washington football team beat the Panthers this day, which was really exciting. Um, so yeah, 
I'm doing well, finally. So uh, that script is from Planner Hannah. And then on to the last part of the day, I am most definitely just using a bougie box because I'm over this. Um, we did go to the dog park. So I will use, oh wait. Yeah, I'll use this to mark that we went to the dog park. And then, actually, hmm, yeah, whatever, it's fine. Um, at the end of the night, I did edit, which I did that, this was literally like two nights ago. So I feel like I should remember what happened, but I don't. Um, what was I editing? Is that right? Yeah, okay. What was I editing? Oh, I was editing the plan with me that's going, that went up a week ago for you guys. Um, and then I did, oh. okay, I don't think I can use this guy for that, sorry. I'm going to, this is super hard. When I get to the end of the week, it's always so hard. Okay, so what else do I wanna use? Okay guys, I had to kind of figure out my order because it gets complicated towards the end of the plan with me, what I'm doing. So anyways, we did go to the dog park again which it's just been such a ball going to the dog park i'm not gonna lie um and then we did watch sunday night football and then um i did cuddle jake and then i did edit so for the dog park how do i need a small sticker i wish i had more icons um, let's use this guy from Once More With Love. <clears throat> and I'll put these stickers away. And I have a park script from Scoble Prince Co. Sorry, again, if you guys could hear my heater. Ugh. Um, and then for Sunday Night Football, I have my primetime duo. That's literally what I'm going to start calling it. Um, from Planna Hannah. I'm such a nerd. And then I did, like I said, I cuddled Jake. So let's pull out a sticker for that. Um, sorry, I want to use this bed one. I think it's super cute. Okay, I knew which one I wanted to use, and so it took me forever to get there. So I have that. Oh, I need to put, that is like the bulk of my freaking character storage are those Jake stickers. And then I have a cuddle script, and then I did lastly edit. So I have this YouTube icon from Scribble Prince Co and an edit script. And that is that for my week. All right, you guys, so that is the spread in full. I do have some of these twinkle bits from Scribble Prince Co. I'm gonna try and use, uh, finish up this sheet and then just use some of these. And I'm gonna just put these in the empty spaces that I see there needs a little something. I feel like this totally completes a spread. I. I think I've done this with like every spread for as long as I can remember. So I just really like doing this part of it. Um, I think it's totally worth it. It is kind of tedious, but I don't know. I kind of like it. So anyways, that is the spread in full. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm sorry. I was kind of all over the place. I am not sober. So <laughs> it is again, like almost the holiday break. For, I mean, it technically is the holiday break for me, but I just wanted to get this filmed so that I didn't have to worry about 
posting it later or like fall behind or get stressed or anything. And I was in the filming mood. So I was like, why not? Um, but yeah, so let me know where you guys shopped on Black Friday because by the time this is posted, it would have passed. But I'm curious where you guys shopped. Oh, I didn't use more of those. I just, I didn't really use a lot of icons this week because I didn't have a foil bundle. So that stinks. I really like using those in the kit. I think they're fun. Um, oh, this looks so cute. Do you guys love the rose gold with this? I could have also seen gold with this for sure. I think that would have looked so cute. Um, but I just, I try and change up my foil as much as I can. And I feel like I was using a lot. I've been using so much gold lately. And I know I have because I literally have like no gold bougie boxes or anything left. So I've been needing the foil bundles for those. Um, but I think for Black Friday, there's like a hair on my paper. I'm definitely going to try and stock up on some bougie boxes because it does just make life so much easier. A lot of people like, I wouldn't say admire me doing these half cut headers. I finished that sheet, um, but they're like, I don't know. I think a lot of people have messaged me that they don't have the patience and stuff. And like, now I'm losing my patience. So I see what you all meant. Um, I will like obviously use up mine most likely but I just am like over it for now because the foil bundles have completely changed me. And I'm pretty sure when I started getting foil bundles, which was this year with the bougie boxes included, I was like, this is not going to be good for me. I'm going to fall in love with the bougie boxes. And sure enough, I did. So that sucks for me or sucks for my wallet, I guess. Um, why is that sticker not laying down? Uh, yeah, but I think this spread is super cute. It's super whimsical-y, which I love. Um, I don't know who this artist is. I don't think I follow them because I don't think I saw this on my feed. Um, but it's super cute. Why is there, like, a hair on my spread? Oof. Okay, so I have this much left over, which is like enough for one spread, which is perfect. Um, I did add this quote, which this says the year is ours or yours. Obviously, it's like the end of the year. So <laughs> that's a great quote. It's definitely a New Year's quote, but I put it there because I needed something there. So I need to buy. That's the other thing. I think I'm going to buy some quote overlays and stuff because I kind of do need some. So anyways. This is what this spread is looking like in full. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm sorry I was a little all over the place, um, but I think this turned out super, super cute. Please subscribe to my channel, like this video, comment down below. Follow me on my planner Instagram at Laura Marie Plans if you don't already. I hope you guys enjoy this video and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!